guys can see I already started taking off the bed liner because I'm gonna go ahead and respray all of it. You guys know when I had the suspension work done, I didn't um, take the bed to get new bed liner sprayed when it was in the shop. I always said I would do it later and OTM's right around the corner, so I want it to look good. I'm gonna go ahead and re bed liner the whole bed. Well, boys, we on that OTM crunch. We just finished pulling all the bed liner out of the truck. It was a pain in the ass. Our hands are all jacked up. You see little cuts there. But we cut them out, drank some micheladas, took out the bed liner between Alex, Robert, and myself. You know, we got these uh, tail lights that I picked up. Um, we're gonna go ahead and swap them out, so. place as you guys saw um so yeah he said be here first thing in the morning it's nine o'clock so fishing to go inside the guy that i talked to yesterday mentioned that he had someone else lined up first thing this morning but if he didn't show up then mine was going to go in in front of him so um i guess we'll run in there and check and see if that other person showed up if not so that way they can go ahead and get started on this one so let's go in there and see what they got so already talked to the guy told him exactly what pressure to put it at so he can turn with no problem. I'm just a little nervous because I've never had anybody else or I've never let anybody else drop my truck, but putting it at the PSI that I told him to put it at, he shouldn't have no problem turning those front wheels. So I'm waiting on an Uber to pick me up because uh, my lady's at school taking a test and uh, everybody else is working. So yeah, I'm waiting on an Uber to pick me up so I can head back to the house porque El compa Mac no ha comido el cabrón, and I gotta feed him, so. So I just got home. Compa Mac is eating his breakfast. Este cabrón, he don't even chew his food. He just like slurps it. Like he ain't ever ate before. Qué bárbaro. I was looking up on YouTube, and some guy used this for some bed liner, and they picked it up. I bought this. I'm sure you can find it like at Ace Hardware, at Lowe's. I bought it at Home Depot. I think it was like 20 bucks. Yo vi que tenía light spots in the bed liner. So I didn't want to apply this on there. Y luego run the, the risk of the paint coming off. También uh, eating through that bed liner and picking up the paint. Hey guys, I just got a call from the shop telling me that the truck is ready. So we're fixing to go run out there real quick and pick it up so yeah a ver como salio but yeah here we are back in la big lips and wide hips um bed liner's complete uh, we're fixing to head back to the house uh, i'll show you guys what it looks like it look it came out pretty good uh first time trying this place out here in town so just got home and uh here it is it came out good i think looks good there's what it looks like OTM Crunch. Ya no más falta lavarla because this thing's filthy. Filthy. We'll wash it tomorrow or Friday. Así para allá irla a ir a... Ya ven? Para irla a drop off allá al, al event. Y fierro. Hey, so it's Friday. Tomorrow's OTM. But... There's still quite a bit that we have to do to get ready for tomorrow. Right now I'm fixing to go pick up some shirts in Houston. Some shirts that we had made for the show uh, for us. Some polos, you guys will see those whenever I pick them up. Y luego we gotta come back and I have to wash the truck. Y luego after that, we're gonna meet up Juan and Edgar with Troqueando up at the track where the event's gonna go down tomorrow. Um, we're gonna go ahead and drop off their trailer and I'm gonna drop off the truck. Because if you've ever been to OTM, estos cabrones ni pa trabajar, not even for work, they wake up that early to line up, right? So if you've ever been to OTM, you guys know that people start lining up like at 3, 4 o'clock in the morning. That's what I'm saying. They don't even get up that early for work. It's just going to be too much of a hassle to wait till Saturday to drive the truck up there. So we're going to drive it up there um, this afternoon. Uh, we got to go pick up beer and all kinds of other stuff. So yeah, I'm definitely going to bring you guys along. But for now, we're gonna go pick up the shirt. So yeah, let's hit the road. Hey, so I just got home from picking up the shirts. Obviously, ya me cambié porque go wash la mamalona. Pero let me show you guys what these shirts look like. So I posted them on Instagram. And I've been getting a uh, lot of questions about if we are selling them. So these we're not selling because these we made 
um, for us for tomorrow, like I said, for OTM. Pero while I was there, I did go ahead and place an order for new shirts and hoodies, a different design. But let me show you guys what these shirts look like. So we got the big lips, white hips, uh, logo on the back. It came out, I think it came out badass. Um, y luego, um, it has like the name on the front, right? El Copa Mac. Look at his chops. And then we did this here. So I put the intro on mine. Y luego, of course, we got the Chevy on the other side. But yeah, those are the shirts that we made. New shirts, new hoodies are going to be posted on the website soon. So truck's been washed. It's 5 till 6. Y quedé de verme con Juan and Edgar with Troqueando at the racetrack at 6. So plan is to go up there, drop off the truck. For now, uh, we're going to go ahead and head up to the racetrack. El compa Alex is going to meet us up there. So yeah, let's hit the road. Nice. It's a nice truck. I'm gonna have to come pick up a shirt tomorrow. I think the, the winner took the cash instead. So it's kind of hard to see, right? But everybody's just pretty much setting up right now. Drastic, Finesse, Team Billet, um, Swallow Mob, Regicide. We're back here con uh, Juan and Troqueando. Uh, obviously, Freddy's here, right? So, uh, yeah, pretty much everybody's setting up right now. Así para que ya mañana, um, little details and stuff like that, they have, uh, they'll be ready, right? It'll be less stuff for them to do. Borracho Micha Mix just pulled up. Pero, yeah, um, aquí andamos. So, posted up at the Troqueando tent. Um, we're gonna back the truck up y luego probably call it a night because we're gonna set up in the morning so yep gotta be cans 624 packs six what he bought yeah bro how fucking many beers we're not gonna drink all that who said that you're gonna babysit one beer for like three hours. No, I'll go out of the kit. I'm buying 18. Actually, I can't get drunk because I gotta drive my truck home. Yeah, that's your cop out. After you get so Oh, me too. Sober up then, ho. Gotta be the freeloader sometimes. I got no cans, bro. Hey. <laughs> Where the cans at, kit? You guys wanna buy some ammo? <laughs> Buy some penis larger tools. Oh, fuck it. It. I just literally put my key in there. Oh, and just crazy. twisted, bitch. I can't unlock. I can't lock. They didn't specify mask. What are you picking up? Full parindo. Looking for it. That's it. Two hundred and fifty-eight likes on the condom I left. A condom. <laughs> no, on the comment I left on somebody else's video like two weeks ago. Right? 258 likes? 298. No, What'd you comment? This nigga fucking sold his V6 Camaro for a fucking V8 RT charger. And I said, LOL, now you can get gapped in by V8 truck. No, by trucks in a V8 instead of a V6. <laughs> <laughs> Dead. I mean, deceased. You should have been like, <laughs> <laughs> Hey, let me ask y'all a question. <laughs> Who's taking me home? You got the Lyft app or Uber app? I nope. think we might have a discount code for BLWH. I gotta check with my reps. Well, boys, that's gonna be it. It's uh, midnight and we've gotta be bright and early tomorrow morning. So that's gonna be it for this video. Thank you guys again for the support. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. See you on the next one. Peace.